Hello everyone, Xenoism here, and welcome to a let's play I've been slightly dreading. Xenoblade Chronicles 1 Definitive Edition. I will be real. I'm slightly, slightly nervous. Because this, until the third game, was my favorite game of all time. Also, this is a screen for beating the game and Future Connected. But, I was like, you know what? I need to do this. For, even though Zimbly Pro is free, my blind let's play has been recorded. This needs to be done before then. I don't plan on going through all the side quests. So if you're looking for a 100% side quest guide, go watch Chugga Conroy. It's the one, it's one guy where I, he does this stuff really well. Uh, but the quests I will do are going to be, as I'm going to call them, the quests for the Monado Arts, the quests to get to the Monado Arts, so I can have to raise rank of Magna Forest, the Colony 6 quest of building up, because we'll get to that later, and the best side quest in the main game, if you know what it is. You know. But, otherwise, but we're going into a new game. Because I played Zero Chronicles 2, we can start with 100,000 gold. Uh, if you haven't got it, don't worry. I don't plan to use it too much. It's more for getting our books, which I'll talk about when we get them. Now, let's begin. Long ago, the world was nothing more than an endless sea, cloaked in a boundless sky, reaching as far as could possibly be imagined. Then two great titans came into existence. The Bionis and the Maconis. Titans were locked in a timeless battle. Until at last, only their lifeless corpses remained. Eons have passed. Now, our world, this vast land stretching across the remains of the Bionis, is under attack from a relentless force known as the Mekon.
They're advancing down our weak right flank. For a bunch of Solar's machines, they seem to know a thing or two. But we'll see. Young man. We've been given the order to retreat. We're pulling back the line to Colony 6. That's where we'll set up the last line of defense. Yeah. That's a good idea. Any more time spent hanging around here, and we're done for. Count me in. We gotta get out of here. Or we can stay and fight. What? Ah! We uh. may die if we take a stand here, but staying gives us the chance to change our destinies. We have the Monado. With this, the future is ours for the taking. Stupid beast. Your body can't take any more of the Monado. I can tell by just looking at you. Getting short-sighted in your old age, Dixon. I'm fine. Don't worry, I'm still in control. Hmm. I should have known I couldn't talk sense into a beast. Let's do this. I'm going with you. You'll need someone to drag your corpse off. As long as you think you've still got the strength in you, old man. Oi, you two! We've been ordered to pull back! I'm leaving! Well, I say you're coming with us. What would we do without those? <sighs> The enemy's second wave is approaching! It's now or never, Dunban. Let's show them what we got. We'll give them a warm Homs welcome. Acknowledged. Yeah! Ha! What are they trying to prove? I'm not throwing my life away. No point dying in some godforsaken field. Nothing for it. I'll have to use Dunban as a decoy. Yeah, that should give me time to escape. <laughs> Well, we know we're going to get betrayed, so it's time to fight. Tor approach tor 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 oh, attack. And this is the only game of the next that has you attacking or moving. So, we've got two arts, Monado and Chat. But we also have another art. Just Manado, Buster. But we'll get to Buster soon. Prepare for the next fight. Target. Nice. I was grind up. Now let's go and use Monado Buster. Half damage. That's just slowly cut up. Monado. You gotta be kidding. It's their main force. Looks like the Mechon are hell-bent on taking us out. They'll have to be if they want to beat us. Now, let's even the odds a bit. You heard him. Dixon, Munka, let's do this. Dumb 
down that easily. Tombat! Are you alright? Oh, what does it look like? I'm still good to go. <laughs> Guess even a hero's gotta reach his limit eventually. Mumkar! What are you doing? That way is... Sorry, brothers. Hate to drop this on you, but it's the Monado they're after. So have fun keeping them occupied for me. I'm getting the hell out of here. Mumka, you just... Now, oh, don't worry. I'll organize your funerals. <laughs> well, see you, boys. Wait. Huh? Ah! Oh. If this is a joke, it ain't funny. Looks like this is it. At least we know our luck can't get any worse from here. Dumban? Dixon, take care of the survivors. Dumban, what are you playing at? <sighs> Those idiots. I'll just come and get the Monado when everything's quiet down a bit. That thing's gonna be mine! <laughs> the hops. The people of Bionis are just waiting here for you to pick us off. You are sorely mistaken. How we begin this game. God, this game is such a good game. And I like the new title screen. Intro screen, technically. A mech on M71. I bet I can use its optical system to align one of the anti-air batteries. Ah, oh, no good. It's broken. The joint section. It's buckled. It's completely useless. Ugh. An M69! <sighs> its armor would be perfect for making a shield. If I can just get it off, I should be able to... Ah! Ah! <sighs> Shulk! Ah! Ryan! It's not a mechon. It's just a crabble. It was using the mech on armor as a shell. I'll lure it away and topple it. When it's down, use your arts to finish it off. And now we're playing... ...as Shulk. And now... ...we've got... ...new sets of ours. Using Light Heal. You cannot use the same one repeatedly, and it has a set cooldown. Our robot attacks instead fill up the Talon Gauge. And then we can just use Turn Strike. Nice job, everyone. Let's not lose our heads, though. But we can't leave because we've got a barrier in the way. So we've got. Find the monster that's stopping us from escaping. Which is just a tutorial enemy. And there we go. There's me. Wait, how the hell are you? We've almost got her. Let's go! 
Thanks, Ryan. That was a close one. Man, what were you doing wandering off by yourself? Stay where I can keep an eye on you. It's pretty dangerous outside of the colony. There are all kinds of monsters. Yeah. But thanks to you, we got its shell. Everyone in the colony is going to be really happy. I'm more worried about you than the shell. Oh, whatever. Knowing what you're like, at least you'll make a decent weapon out of it. This scrap driver's excellent. I just learned by watching Dixon make weapons. Of course, Dunban's weapon still beats them all. The Monado. I hope I can figure out the secret of his power one day. You will, Shult. Anyway, we better get back to the colony. If I'm late for drills again, old Square Tash is gonna kill me. Square Tash? Oh, the Defense Force Colonel. He's pretty scary. Tell me about it. Sorry, I didn't mean for you to come all the way out here during your break. Don't worry about it. Let's get back. With that, the game truly begins. And we can review tutorials. And the other event here is now available. But, let's look. Our equipment. All right, but we do have some gear. Yet, yeah, no, we don't really. <laughs> but being honest, I am going to put. No, actually, is it calling type one? Yeah. That's yeah. I'm putting everyone in column type 1 because that's how everyone starts off. So, I'm also going to be putting everyone in their first weapon type they get. Oh. This is actually Colony 4. Yeah, no, crew is just nothing. Might be Colony Type 4. Some menu. Clear appearance. What's your. What's this gear? Right. Okay, so it's so yours is middle type for some reason. But yeah, I'm putting everyone in middle type. Everyone's going into their specific armor, and I'm giving you the scrap driver. And. So we did that, we got the achievement, Backstabber. Achievements are a thing in this game, and they give us experience. We're getting over to what... There we go. And we've got multiple chests. Oh, we've got a name top early, Jesus. Uh... Do I give him? No, I don't. We'll give Shulk it, though. Cause that's pretty good. It's pretty good early gear to get. We do have Auto Run! One of the best features they added in. Couple collectibles for the Collectopedia. We'll talk about the Collectopedia later. But yeah, again, I won't be doing this. And this feature is amazing. I like how we can just Get memorized by a story just by paying the art. Uh, 
However, while there won't be focus on other requests, I will still do them, but they're only going to be off-screen because... Mainly because, well, it's a case of you guys can do these quests at any time, so it ends up being up to you guys. Here we are. I better stop in at HQ. You off to the weapon development lab? Yeah, when I've sold any parts I can't use. All right. See you later. Now, we lost Ryan. And we can go to the shop and accept I need to quests and trade. And we get gained a level and a finish going. We'll talk about what I think we see later. But first, yes, I know about buying items. Uh, I won't be buying any of these yet. Nine cap. Nine top, you've already got. Protect your amulet might be good, but not right now because we can't get stuff like that. Nine bottoms. Nine shoes. Uh, we haven't learned it yet, but we do want to have this. We do want to have this. We do want to have this, and we do want to have this. Like I said, most of our gold is going to be spent on art books, so it's not going to be too big a deal that you guys don't keep up. In this game, specifically, uh, all the art books are used effectively. Oh no, it's not. I thought it was. Oh wait, because we haven't gotten to the Today. being able to upgrade arts. So while you guys will be seeing me grabbing quests for the most part. You won't be seeing me actually clearing them unless they're random NPC quests. Finish arm. Hello. That is a unique monster quest, which is going to be fun to do. Hello. Nope. Well. Gem man. Who's there? I don't. I want your stuff. Give me your stuff. Right now, we want to give. Right now, we want to give Shulk the strength up and HP up for now. Mainly because that HP up will be really useful. Hi there. And you have a lot of quests, if I remember, which is going to be good for experience. Hi there. Hi there. You really hate these monsters, eh? I forgot how many quests. Shadow's up there, so we need to find a way up there. You guys won't be seeing me collecting quests all the time, so. Oh! You're down here. Hello! Nice. It's nice to glide. Oh, now getting to one of 
some people's favourite cutscenes. Eh, it's good, but it's not that great. What the hell are you playing at? Uh-oh. The colonel's gonna explode. Crashing the mobile artillery into a house. How long have you been in the force? Sorry, sir. It's just that we were trying to go as fast as we could, like you ordered. But it's impossible to get back to the military district in only 40 seconds. I don't want any excuses. Champions don't whine. They win. Yes, sir. You're a disgrace to the uniform! Are you forgetting the shame you brought on this force during joint maneuvers with Colony 6? Stick your back into it, maggots! Move it! Yes, sir. Get the artillery back to the military district double time! Then I want a million press-ups from both of you, and you better not stop until your biceps explode! Colonel, we can't move the artillery. What? You better give a damn good reason why. Sir, the impact of the crash damaged the ether conduction cable. The ether fuel proceeded to leak out, and now the cylinder is empty. Well, change the cylinder then. Can't you even do something as simple as that? The auxiliary cylinders have all been used up. It'll be three days until more come in, sir. I told you to keep a stock of fuel in reserve. Sorry, sir. You're nothing but slackers! Same old Colonel. At this rate, the men will all be dead before they see any action. <sighs> Vangar. One of the best characters. <laughs> but seriously, this guy... Not this guy, but Vangar was actually called Vandom in the Japanese version. What's up? Why is this important? In every Xeno game, there's a Vandom. What's up? That's the only reason. So, this guy is this game's Vandom. Also, if we'll come up here, we can see Rhine doing push up. Nice touch! Yes. Evil Rangord. Okay, I don't believe we can. We should go up. No, we don't need to go up there. Uh... But yeah, other than that, remember that music for later. Shulk, how are you? Dixon! When did you get back to Colony 9? <laughs> Just now. I see you've been busy. Looks like your Monado research has been going well. I made the right choice leaving you in charge. <laughs> your research notes really helped. So, you can activate it now then. Well, anyone can activate it. The problem is controlling it. Yeah, for everyone except him. Yes. If anyone other than Dunban were able to control the Monado, we could surpass any military force in the world. You think so? What are these hidden functions you mention? It's still only conjecture. But it's starting to look like the Monado might be something far more significant than just a weapon for defeating Mechon. I see. And the evidence to support your theory? It's the symbol that appears in the center when it's activated. What I know is, the central piece is made from multi-layered glass. The symbol appears on the top layer 
and each layer is constructed differently. So it's possible that other symbols could appear on different layers. Which means... The Monado might conceal even more power. Am I right? If we could just... unlock the Monado's power... Dunban! Dunban! Prioritize the most severely injured! Come on, get a move on! Dunban! Don't look like that. I haven't come yet. Shulk. Supplies delivered to the defense force. I'll drop round the HQ and see how they're getting on. Okay, then. I'll see you later. Shulk, you're spending too much time in the lab. Either that or rummaging for junk in the scrapyard. It ain't healthy for a kid your age. That's why you're always looking so pasty. You should get out, get some fresh air once in a while. All right, I'm off. <laughs> Is it time to eat already? You didn't have to bring it yourself. You could have just called me. Don't be silly. Do you want me to feed you? <laughs> Don't treat me like an invalid. I'm better than I was a year ago. Much better. Oh, I really thought I lost you back then. Yes, but now I'm almost well enough to handle the Monado again. Dunban, don't say that. The Meccan have gone now. Oh, why would you say that? I just mean I'm prepared. Sorry. Okay. More importantly, eat up before it gets cold. I made something really special today. Don't feel like you need to stay here then, Fiora. Go and make your next delivery. Huh? Well, I'm sure you'd like Shulk to try some while it's still hot. That's okay. Shulk has no sense of taste. He'll say it's delicious even if it's stone cold. <laughs> In which case, today he would actually mean it. Hmm, maybe. I'm fine, Fiora. Off you go. Okay. Dunban, thanks. finished yet. I have to be prepared to use the Monado again. That must be so painful. And ignoring that, I think that's implying Dumban's usual arm is his right. Oh, imagine getting used to doing stuff with your right arm and then having to do stuff with your left, and you're not used to it. Oh. Hey, 
Hey, Fiora. Dixon. Looks like you're in a hurry. Where are you off to? I just thought I'd take Shulk some food. I'm on my way to the lab. Shulk's not there right now. Really? I just sent him out to get some fresh air. You know where he'll have gone. Outlet Park. That's the one. Okay. Thanks, Dixon. Now let's go. Get Fiora some gear. Well. Bye. Fence knives. Nine gear. Hunting knives. Defense knives. Go to Outlet Park. Might do some battles on the way just to keep things fresh. Sweet wasabi. Combat sound feels so weird. sword that's effective against the Mechon armor. They say that before time began, it was wielded by the Bionis. The same Bionis that we all live on. It must have a secret. That's how Dunban was able to destroy so many Mechon. And why he lost the use of his right arm. If I can just unlock the secret of its power. Shulk! Fiora! Mm. This is great. It tastes so good. Really? It's amazing. Oh, Shulk. You say that every day. Not quite. Mm. It's always delicious. But today, it's amazing. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, thank goodness. I used some special herbs and spices today. So if you said it was just the same as usual, I'd know for sure you had no sense of taste. What? Oh, nothing. The breeze feels so good. Yeah. I'd forgotten what it feels like. I never thought it could be so quiet here. You're spending too much time with Ryan. You're getting used to all the noise he makes. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so peaceful. You know, Shulk, I hope every day can be like this always. Huh? The debris siren. Strange. There hasn't been much falling lately.
there might be more on the way. The anti-air batteries can't protect us out here. Let's get back to the lab. Okay. Nom, 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 nom. I'm biting this infinite sandwich. <laughs> that scene will never not be funny. Now to finally do heart hearts, let's switch to party leader. So, if we switch to party, we can switch to party leader. I like playing a shop. So, but also, oh, no, we don't have it yet. Oh, but we can do the heart to heart. Sunrise in the park. And we want to fill this completely and horribly. Because I invited you. You wanted to marry me. Yes, this is for an achievement. Heartbreaking. Such. Such a nice moment though. I don't even feel we can see Party Affinity yet. Because we need to get all three in one. But now we can actually do this. I'm got a slight edge. But uh you know. Should be okay if we fight like this. Well, Ryan might have a new weapon. I'm not even worried about what Fiora wears because, well, she doesn't stay in the party long, which is unfortunate. But the blood demands it. Me. Quest complete. I can feel the power. I can feel the power. And we've got a new art, which should be, if I'm remembering correct, Stream Edge. One of my favorite artists in this game. It's not well. my absolute favorite, but hey. Again, it's really hard to cite my absolute well. favorite art. Oh, we already completed. Great. Once we've got the ability to actually level up arts, I will then finally start talking about each character. Once Yora's back in the party, probably. Ryan? Ryan! What are you doing? Sh Shulk! Uh, um, no, I'm, I'm, I'm just... No! Ah! Ah! Goodness. Oh, Fiora, are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. 
Ah, uh, it's broken. What? What do you mean it's broken? Don't you care about me? I could have died. You're not hurt, are you? The Monado can't cut people. More importantly, what were you thinking, Ryan? Sorry, I, I came to ask a favor, but you weren't here. And I saw the Monado and... I know I'm here a lot, but even I need fresh air sometimes. Is your body still feeling numb? We have to be very careful with the Monado. It's not a toy. I know, man. I just wanted to touch it. Didn't know it would do that. Sorry. But is it true? The Monado really can't cut people. The pattern in that circle. Or maybe it's a symbol. I think it shows which power the Monado has at the moment. You think it's a symbol? Well, if I can find a way to increase the number of symbols, I should. I'm sure that's all very clever. But why were you more worried about a machine than me, Shulk? Well, I just... I just explained why. That's not the point! Uh, s sorry. this happened there Ryan Fiora are you okay does it hurt no Ryan when you held the Monado did you see anything you know like a blue blade made of light came out same as just now I don't mean that a feeling like time had stopped and then time had stopped so was it only me who saw that? That sounds strange. Is it another Monado thing? Who knows? Anyway, no matter how good a sword it is, that's what happens when you hold it. Looks like Dunban really is the only one who can use it. I won't let my brother use it ever again. Not after what it did to him. Oh, sorry. I, I didn't mean it like that. Anyway, the point is I'm fine. To be honest, this has happened a few times before. I've been researching the Monado for a long time. Shulk, don't act as if this is nothing. Look, don't worry about it. Anyway, Ryan, what did you want to ask me about? Oh, yeah, uh, old Square Tash has gone and put me on punishment duty. Fancy tagging along? Punishment? The Colonel was pretty angry today. Did he hit you? Well, whether he hit me is neither here nor there, really. Although, actually, he did end up hitting me. And that ain't all. He made me do a thousand squats and sit-ups. Whoa. Nasty. Yeah. And now I have to go all the way to the Magmel ruins and back. So you have to go and collect the ether cylinders? That's the one. They're used to power the mobile artillery. Looks like the damage has been repaired. They can't move without the ether energy. And it seems like the fueling station's all out of stock. Is the mobile artillery that big machine that crashed in the residential district? Yeah, probably. You know your way around there, right? Oh, come on. There we go. Yeah. Okay, I'll go with you. Yeah. Knew you would. Hold on. The Magmel ruins are in Tefra Cave, right? I heard that there's a male lizard nest there. I couldn't take it if anything happened to Shulk. He's delicate. Not like you, Ryan. What are you on about? I'll be fine. I can take care of myself. But... Okay, I got it. I'll make you a promise. Shulk won't even get a scratch. A promise doesn't mean much coming from you.
Hmm. She don't trust me at all. Nah, she doesn't mean it. And I think... Since... Yes, finally. I'll talk about Shulk and Ryan, and we'll use that to end the episode. So... Actually, before you. Uh, no, I, I like it how it is. So, Shulk! Shulk is a glass cannon. But he has light heal, which makes him bits are even the most. To spoil, Shulk only gets eight normal arts. And the trailers don't hide it. He gets, eventually gets the ability to use the Monado, and he has eight Monado arts once we unlock them all, via story and via side quests. I will explain more of that. Rhine! Rhine is a tank. Fru and fru, you're mainly going to be seeing him trying to draw aggro. With this game, Ryan ends up getting a bit of a boost because of how this game was made with two extra uh, book slots, effectively. Now we can go into skill trees. Intu intuition? Because the rest of this is just better. Strength up. No, agility's not good. We don't have skillants yet, but we can get we'll get them soon. Just get rid of that. But with that, we now we now really only have. One thing we can do, which is head to Catherine Cave. Sorry. But we'll be doing that next time. So, with a new save file made, next time we will end up, well, Going to make going to Magma Ruins. I don't know where I was going with it, sorry. <laughs> See you guys then.